Uh, good morning, everyone. Welcome to Tuesday, September 19th, you guys. Good morning. So this is actually, it's really interesting, right? Welcome to, welcome to Tuesday. Because from now, we're getting into board games, you guys. Rain, uh, Rain can you stand when you walk, please? Thanks. So we're getting into board games now, but not just regular board games. We're going to be reviewing money as well as more of our introductions, more of our answers. One answer equals one position. So as you make your way down the board game, you have many positions in the board game, right, Habito? Many positions. Every answer gets you one new position. So what is your name? My name is Greg. How are you feeling? I am feeling happy. What is your favorite food? My favorite food is spicy pasta. So every answer gives you one position. Okay, Mariko, it told me for the Tuesday class. Every answer gives you one position. And so, all right. So let's get to it. Here's number one, you guys. First word is, first two words are board game. There it is, you guys. There's your board game, you guys. Very, very cool. And here, let's go on. Oh, look at this over here. I can play it. Hibito, you can play with the Tommy over there, okay, Hibito? Uh, so nothing with the phone. Mariko, Mariko, look at Greg. Nothing with the phone right now, please. Put it away and just let's focus on the students only, okay? Thanks, Mariko, thanks. I can play it, you guys. I can play it. There it is, everybody. Very nice. And here comes the next one. One, one, two, two. Let's get familiar with the numbers with the letters. Okay, it works like this, you guys. One, one, two, two. And here comes number four. Wow, this is tricky. Look at this. This is really cool. One, two, three, four. One answer equals one position. So one, one answer, one position, one answer, one position, and dum 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 dum. What number comes up here? That's number seven, eight, nine, ten. You got it, you guys. You can write your numbers up there. Okay, here we go. Answer equals answer. P equals A equals answer. P equals position. Kaito, could have careful with that, please? All right, so here, answer equals position. Answer equals P for position. Position, wait a minute, missing answer, oh no. Fill in your words, you guys, you got it. That was fun. That's right, you guys, that's right. Here comes number six. Nick, you're doing great over there, Nicholas. Here's number six. A equals answer, P equals position, Y equals yen, you guys. 100 yen in this case. All right, so 100 yen, 200 yen, 300, 400, 500, 600, you guys. This is one of two, so you cannot, you cannot start with number seven. If you want to do number seven, you have to start with actually number six. Here it is. I have to give how many answers? Look at your board game part of it. Look at the board game and figure out how many, how many answers do you have to give? And then how many answers means how many positions? And then if every position is 100 yen, then how much yen can you earn? That's right, that's number seven, you guys. Tricky, tricky. Having fun with the board games? Yeah, me too, this is number eight. Number eight, how many positions can you move? Well, here's your answer one. My name is, that's one answer, one position. I am how many years old? That's two answers, how many positions? I am feeling extremely happy today. So how many answers is that? How many answers is that? How many positions is that? Well, you wanna start, you wanna start here. So then how many positions do you move, you guys? You can, you can color. So Mariko and Antonio, you can color those positions. So how many positions are you going to color? All right. And here's number nine. Before we get to some review from last week, here's number nine. Wow. Each position is worth 100 yen. I can earn how much yen at the finish? Here's the start. Here's the finish. Make your way down, you guys. 
So, if that's the start and that's the finish, how much yen can you earn? How much yen can you earn by finishing, by finishing up the the board game? Can you run and check the sink, make sure that its water's flowing nicely and that it's not swiveling? Thanks, because someone's running right now. So that's it, you guys. From number ten, we're getting into a little bit of review from last week. So. Some, uh, but the ones that are coming on Tuesday, when you're watching this video, you did not touch any of those. Number 10 talks about the board game, right? You have to write all your words here that connect to HKIS. And here, this board game is all about what? Look at the picture. This board game is about the park. Each space is worth 100, each space is worth 150 yen. At the end, how much yen can you earn? Tricky, tricky. 150, 150, 150, 150, 150. How much is your total at the end? Okay, you guys. And then number 12, wow. If each space was worth 500 yen, I could earn how much yen when I reach the end? Well, how much, you guys? And here's number 13. I can find the what kind of store, right? Getting back to a bit of review there, you guys. So yes, we're getting into board games. It's the very first time that we've ever covered board games at this school. But we're not just doing regular board games, no. Our board games connect in with previous curriculum topics. So the previous curriculum of money. And also questions and answers. Don't forget, don't forget your past, present, future. Okay, you guys? So. Board games at HKS are not like regular board games. So let's get into some really interesting topics and then communicate about those topics. Answer your questions to move your positions. Okay, that's it. If you're watching this video, it means that you already hopefully watched the Family Tent Night video. Did you see the fireworks? Did you see the, the movie outside? So much fun, you guys. Hope you can join me for next the next Family Tent Night. Alright, so I'm gonna sign off now. See you guys later. Bye everybody. Bye.